This is impacting a lot of people, Jason. Uh, impacting nearly the entire state. There's spots to the west where it's not quite as bad. Areas like Council Bluffs and upwards towards Sioux City. But you can see that area in red and worse the area in purple. That goes from unhealthy to very unhealthy. So all of us being impacted by that. You can see just kind of the haze that's hanging over right now. And uh, limiting visibility in spots. Again, that's coming from wildfires upwards into Canada. That's smoke traveling over the Great Lakes off to the southwest. So it, portions of the U.S. like Chicago, upwards towards Milwaukee, Green Bay, Wisconsin, and down towards us. Air quality is pretty atrocious. And you can see it there looking at Algona right now. You can see the haze that they've got going on on that main stretch. Marshalltown, very hazy as well. So again, not a whole lot of us excluded from this. Looking outside right now, still just kind of a general haze. We're coming in at 70 degrees. That breeze out of the east at 14 miles per hour. On top of that haze, we've got showers and some of us are waking up to some thunderstorms out there. Rain falling along Highway 69. Uh, that expanding eastward towards Waterloo. And you can see a little bit further to the southeast, we've got general showers, Oskaloosa down towards Centerville. These are going to continue to push to the east. We've got more rain working its way in from Nebraska and we'll keep some chances alive as we head into the afternoon. Temperatures though climbing back up into the mid to upper 80s. I do think uh, some of us touch upwards towards 90 today. So uh, tracking out the showers, you can see a bulk of that clears. We've got more chances as we head into the evening and overnight multiple round potential here as we bring in heavier rain south of I-80. Uh, and Then heading into the day on Thursday, it looks like we could see an isolated shower thunderstorm as well. Severe chances are not high today. Could we see a, a wind gust or large hail? It is possible, though odds will be uh, better for that, or I should say higher for that, for southeastern portions of the state tomorrow. Eight day forecast, temperatures cooling off. We're down to 82 on Saturday with sunnier skies. Rain chances though off and on through the weekend with a drier start to your next week.